Hello everybody, this is Nick and I'm back with programming. Today we're in processing, I've created a little application, a demonstration of draggable windows in processing. It's object oriented uh, code and uh, let's take a look at it. Yeah, as you can see I got two windows with uh, children inside. These are children and they're draggable, it's blue and orange, they have uh, name titles. and. Uh, if I drag them, the FPS uh, on the right down corner doesn't fall uh, doesn't fall uh, too much. It's just uh, like half or uh, or one e a frame per second fall. And if I have uh, more of them, of course, it's gonna fall. But I'm recording with fraps here, and it's uh, it's kind of and uh, the fraps fault but it's efficient and uh, the it's object oriented code and yeah that's that's the demonstration it's pretty simple now you can close them too but uh, the code uh, the, the code is pretty simple too it's just this is just a temporary code that I'm uh, creating the windows heading ch uh, children to them and that's uh, that's a drawing method that uh, I'm drawing every window, so uh, the window class is uh, pretty simple. You can extend it and uh, you can do whatever you want. But uh, I'm here uh, because of the draggable, the draggable uh, system. Now, as you can see, when it's pressed, every window when it's uh, when it's pressed, uh, it uh, it checks if it's uh, over the box of the. A window and uh, it locks it uh, that's why uh, we change here the color but uh, the most important part is calculating the offset so it calculates the offset between the cursor and the windows X and Y positions and then when it's tracked it uses that offset to uh, to, uh, to create the new uh, window position so from the cursor it uh, uh, minus the offset it creates the new window position it's pretty simple mathematic uh, mathematics and uh, when it's uh, released uh, you just um, you just uh, un, uh, unlock it and um, that's that's pretty much it uh, uh, there there is a method uh, for adding ch children and whatever the the children can be anything in the window so uh, I have just uh, created the rectangles inside of them and uh, yeah, uh, play around with the code. It's on GitHub. Uh, it will. Yeah, uh, I will appreciate it if you add something and contribute back uh, to GitHub. And uh, I want to make it as quick as possible. So that's it for today, guys. Hope you liked it. Thanks for watching, and I hope I see you again.